Hey y'all, welcome back to Overtime. My name's Evan. And I'm Rayleigh. And, and let's, let's rock, rock and roll. roll. As you saw last week, we started a new segment here on Overtime called Creeping Up on Craig. I'm going to be honest, that was a little bit of a flop, but let's see what you guys think this time. <laughs> Did I get you this time? It's gonna take more than that to scare me. <laughs> In case you didn't know, it's still October, and while last week I tried to do a little bit of a Bill Nye impression without getting copyrighted, this week we're gonna do something a little bit more public domain. So we're doing a pumpkin carving contest. Hey, <laughs> In other words, this is the pumpkin drop challenge, and we have an hour to go get supplies to protect these pumpkins. Let's go. <laughs> okay, so I think my idea is gonna be that we duct tape the whole pumpkin first, like kind of cover it, and then get some pillows for the majority of the bottom since it's harder on the bottom. I don't really have a plan, but my plan is we're gonna make a parachute for the pumpkin. and then we're gonna shove the other hooks in the pumpkin. We got three pillows and two blankets and a roll of duct tape and we're gonna try to see if that works, okay? Okay, so we saw Chris in a store and I'm not even gonna lie, I think we definitely have the upper hand on this because they're not gonna do good. <laughs> I feel like mine's gonna take so much longer than yours. Mine's gonna take like five minutes. I know, but mine's got actual thoughts. <laughs> so anyway, it. what we're doing here is putting hooks in a pumpkin. This is not working out very well right now. I think this is gonna work. my pumpkin. I put some hooks in here, some hooks in this tarp, and we're, <laughs> we're gonna have him fly down like a little baby. <laughs> For my pumpkin, uh, we got two big extra thick pillows on the bottom, and we duct taped them, and then we also duct taped the pumpkin itself so it doesn't come apart, and then we put one on the top just for good measure. Let's go drop the pumpkins. All right, you ready? All right, three, three two, two, one. one. Ah! <laughs> My a little bit, but not a lot. That was not bad. Wait, I'm so excited. Let's go down there. I think I won. I'm gonna, I'm gonna call Morgan on there for this one. This is Morgan. And this is Chris. And this has been the Pumpkin Drop, drop Challenge. Challenge. <laughs> And that's all we got for you on this week's episode of Overtime, guys. And remember, y'all, in the words of the late, great Sophie Barton, everybody has a job to do. Our job is to talk, your job is to listen, challenge for us to finish our job before you can finish your job. We'll, we'll see, see y'all next time. time. Goodbye. 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 Hey, Rayleigh. What? What happened to the students here this week? Oh, that's funny you asked, Evan, because I was there all week. So, starting out on Monday, we had movie night and fellowship with one dollar tacos. And then we did the same old, same old throughout the week, but on Thursday, we had a little spots with an open mic night. Um, I am pleased to announce that Talia Clark won with her majestic, beautiful, angelic princess voice. But we had some great runner-ups. Shout out to Stephen Thomas, Josh Boschers, 
really impressed with them, they're phenomenal. We really have some sheer talent at the CSC. Mm -hmm. Wow, very interesting. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah. My hands getting so tired. Okay, well, <laughs> I guess that's it for you guys. Adios and vaya con Dios. <laughs>